I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on solutions of EQAO Grade Six Assessment. Here we have a very important question from the year 2014 test paper. This is based on probability. Let us try to understand the concept and answer this question. Toby has a bag of 40 colored blocks. Without looking, he reached in and pulls one block out. Complete the table below and determine the probability of a red, green, purple or of the color yellow block. So these are the four colors of which we have the blocks. The number of red blocks are six, number of green blocks is 10 out of 40. And we know that the probability of picking yellow is 0 0.2. So that is it. You need to write down the probability for red, probability for green, probability for purple. That is the exercise, right? For some of the students, let me write down the definition of probability first. So when we are saying probability, then probability of any color, right? Any color will be number of, this is number of that color blocks divided by total number of blocks, right? So that is what the probability is. Now in this particular video, we will show you two different ways of solving this particular question, right? So first method which I am going to use is using probability. Since there are only four colored blocks in this, total probability will be one, right? So let's use that and then solve. So, so we know from here that red, we have six red. So I can write down that the probability for picking up a red block, that is all we can write in short, is six since there are six red blocks over 40, okay? Six over 40 could be written as three over 20, or to make it percent, we'll multiply by five. Five times three is 15, five times 20 is 100, which gives us 0 0.15. So I thought I'll share with you some calculations, but you could use calculator. 6 divided by 40 and get your answer in decimals at 0 0.15, right? You could do that. For green, let's write down the probability. Probability for green is 10 out of 40. I mean, right, 10 out of 40. So 10 out of 40 is 1 over 4. A quarter means 0 0.25. We're already given the probability for yellow, which is equal to 0 0.2. Now, what is the probability for purple? Well, there are four. So probability in all is only one. Take away the probability for red plus probability for green plus probability for yellow. That should give you the probability for purple. You get the idea? So even without calculating the number of purple blocks, we can find the probability using this method, right? Isn't that cool? Let's see how to find the answer now. So we have 1 minus probability for red is 0 0.15, probability for green is 0 0.25, probability for yellow is 0 0.2. So let's add them up. So 1 minus how much? So 5 and 5 is 10. So 0, 1, 3, 4, 5 and 1, 6. So 0 0.60, right? Now 1 minus 0 0.60 is equal to 0 0.40. So the probability for picking up purple is 0 0.40 or 40%, right? Now we know this is 40%. So that is our method one. So I hope you get how to solve without even calculating the numbers, right? Now let us use method two. So method one, I hope you have understood is using the probability, right? So total probability is is 
is 1 and that is how we found this method correct now we are going to use second method which is more common actually so in the second method we'll actually find how many of each type of blocks are there when we know that probability of picking yellow is 0.2 that means what should this number be well that means yellow blocks over 40 should be equal to 0 0.2 right that is the probability right number of yellow blocks over 40 should be 0 0.2 so from here we can find y is equal to 0 0.2 times 40 correct so when you multiply you get this as 8 right 2 times 4 is 8 and that decimal tenths place 8 so we know that the yellow are 8 in numbers total is 40 so how many are purple well the purple should be 40 take away 6 take away 10 take away 8 right so when you take away from 40 when you take away 6 you get 34 take away 10 24 take away 8 you get how many 16 right so you get 16 here so so 24 take away 8 is 16 well you could use the calculator so we'll do using calculator 40 minus 6 minus 10 minus 8 equals to 16 now divide 16 by 40 to get your answer in decimals it gives you 0.4 exactly same answer perfect and then once you know it is 16 then you know 16 over 40 is equal to 0 0.4 we get the same answer so that becomes our second method of doing it right so that is how you could actually solve this question so let me repeat the whole process in the second method we actually found the number of purple blocks by using the probability of yellow which was 0.2 so that gives us that the yellow block should be 8 8 over 40 gives you 0 0.2 once we know that yellow is 8 total is 40 you can find how many purple blocks are there right in first method we found the probability using the principle that the total probability should be 1 since we could calculate probability of three of them probability of fourth should be 1 minus sum of all those probabilities perfect and we found the same answer 40 percent or 0 0.4 for purple so these are the four probabilities for the four colors as required correct so we got probability for red as 0 0.15 probability for green as 0 0.25 probability for purple as 0 0.4 and was already given to us that the probability for yellow is 0 0.2 you will notice that when you add them all you get total as one which should be the case perfect so i hope that helps feel free to write your comment share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for watching and all the best